Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for a moment of silence. Good morning, Elko Eagles. Welcome to Eagles News, keeping you up to date on all Elko things. I'm your announcer today, Angel. And I'm Byron. Today is March 8th. You will have a day two schedule. You will go blocks 5, 6, 7, and 8. The weather today will be partly cloudy. It will reach a high of 60 degrees and a low of 40 degrees. The lunch choices today will include a turkey and cheese salad with homemade croutons and a garlic breadstick, homemade taco salad, soft shell chicken tacos or a grilled cheese sandwich. Festival options are fresh spinach and cherry tomatoes, fresh cucumber slices and green beans. The fruit today is assorted fresh fruit and 100% fruit juice. Today is math day and advisory. I can't wait to see which grade level has the most students participating. This week is school social worker week. Ms. Beck, we appreciate you for all you do in our school community. It's time for spring sports. Try trials for baseball, softball, track, and girls soccer start March 17th. Get your sports physical down done now so you are ready to start when the time comes. Attention becoming queen members. We are back on schedule and ready to meet this Thursday, March 10th, and next Thursday, March 17th, from 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. Each afternoon, put the dates in your calendar. And be sure to remind your parents this week's focus is the gossip track. Henrico High School School Dance will be hosting a spring dance snow on March 10th and March 12th, 7 p.m. Tickets are $5, so bring your family to this amazing show. And here's an announcement from Dr. Mazel. Hey, good morning, good morning, Elko Eagles. I'm going to keep my announcements very brief this morning. First, let me commend you students. Um, I am seeing a change in behavior and for the good. And certainly I want to thank those who are respecting themselves, those who are respecting others, those who are respecting property, our school, and for those who are respecting the learning environment. Thank you. Also, for those who are paying attention and tuning in to our dear Drop Everything and Read, thank you. I certainly want to thank and commend the teachers for volunteering to read to you and students. You should thank them because your teachers are taking time out of their busy schedules to read to you. Also, Pi Day is coming up 314. So which administrator will get Pi? Will it be myself, Miss Swartz, Miss Meeks or Mr. Lee? It's your turn now, so we're looking for your money. All righty, spring sports. Um, I'm strongly encouraging students to think about trying out for our spring sports. Um, as you know, we have girls soccer. We have Mr. Clark and Miss Newbill. We have softball, Miss Wright and Miss Barry. We have baseball, Mr. Lawrence. We have track, Miss Amos and Mr. Brown. So we want to have good sports teams. So please consider trying out. Also, we have cheerleading, no tryouts, but those young ladies will continue cheering our teams on to victory. Students, our hall sweeps will start today. They will start fifth and eighth bell. When the tardy bell rings, students should be in class. Again, when the tardy bell rings, you should be in class. Administrators will be closely monitoring tardies. If you expect to participate in dances, attend our upcoming pep rally, which is March 23rd. You need to be in class on time. 
Also, eighth graders, you have fewer than four months left. The PTSA, as well as teachers, have been busy planning your eighth grade prom, your dance June 3rd, as well as your eighth grade farewell, which is scheduled for June 15th, 14th or 15th. Dates are in my head. At any rate, eighth graders, you should be on your best behavior. Um, again, you have fewer than four months here at Elko and you will be moving to the high school. Also students, SOLs are approaching, so we need you to do your very best. You've also selected your courses for next year. This is a reminder. I know I'm being lengthy, but I want this to sink in. You have until May 27th to change your schedules for next year. This is our seventh, our rising seventh graders and our rising eighth graders. Again, you have until May 27th to see your counselor. Thank you. Let's make this a terrific Tuesday and get to class on time because we want to see the entire school in the pep rally on the 23rd. Thank you. Thanks for listening and we hope you have an amazing day.